Hey guys, it's the outlaw Michael Tomsick with Michael Tomsick Sports Trading Company. And I've not been doing the videos quite on time. I was supposed to do this one last Tuesday. It is currently Saturday night, August 12th. And I wanted to talk to you about proposition bets. This is from the sportsbook William Hill here in Reno. And the fight, as you see, is Mayweather versus McGregor. Prop bets, the fight is on August 26th at T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. So what proposition bets are there, like little side bets you can make on a thing? Most of the sports books here in town do not allow you to um, parlay them together. The only three sports books I know of right now that are still currently taking odds on the fight are the Atlantis Sportsbook, Harris Sportsbook, and William Hill. So if you're in Reno, those are probably the three sports books you're going to have to go to. Last time I was at Peppermill, they were still not taking wagers on the fight. So let's talk about some of these proposition bets. And I'm going to switch the camera around a little bit so you guys can see. So this one is, will Floyd Mayweather win by disqualification? There are the betting numbers for yes and no. And here are the odds. The yes is minus 850. The no is plus 575. So the next proposition, will Conor McGregor get knocked down? So the yes on that is minus $2.60. The no is plus $2.20. Will Floyd Mayweather get knocked down? So it is plus 4 on the yes and minus 5 on the no. Will the fight go the distance 12 full rounds it is plus 250 on the yes and minus 3 on the no will the fight go at least two full rounds it is minus 12 on the yes and plus 750 on the no this is kind of an interesting one because you know if you guys have watched the news later lately McGregor just said he was gonna knock out uh, or yeah McGregor said he was gonna knock out Mayweather in round two so it would be interesting to see if that happens or not. Will the fight go at least four full rounds? So they're minus 380 on the yes and plus 310 on the no. Will the fight go at least eight rounds? So they're saying minus $1.90 on the yes and plus $1.70 on the no. Will the fight go at least 10 full rounds. So it's plus $1.55 on the yes and minus $1.75 on the no. So those are some of the proposition bets you can do as well. There's also another sheet you can do and I will show you here. It is uh, McGregor by KR disqualification, McGregor by um, decision, Mayweather by KO, TKO, or DQ, Mayweather by decision and the draw. And these are the odds over there. It's 5 to 1, 15 to 1, minus $1.30, 9 to 5, and 25 to 1. So then further down here, these are all uh, by the rounds. So you can go all the way up to row 12 on McGregor. And you can see the odds on there. As the rounds go up, the odds are increasing. Now on the other side, you have Mayweather. And it goes all the way up to round 12. And the lower rounds have better odds, the upper rounds have higher odds. And the last, the very last one is a draw at 25 to 1. So these are all proposition bets that you can make on the McGregor and Mayweather fight. Now I posted a blog on my blogger today about uh, the fight because there's been some news. They're thinking about changing from 10 ounce gloves to 6 ounce gloves. And also like I said McGregor posted that he was going to knock out Mayweather in round 2. So those are some of the news updates and updates on this fight. So on Tuesday, I will post my fourth video on this fight. I hope you guys enjoy it. This is the Outlaw Michael Tomsick. You can check me out at www.mtomsick.com.